new video on method so today I'm going to show you uh, something about the analysis of uh, asynchronous motor or induction motor so here is our induction machine and it is uh, rated about I rated about 1.492 megawatts okay and mechanical input is in torque you can change it into speed or mechanical resistance input okay so these are the parameters okay another thing is to about the number of poles number of poles is four pole pier is four so it is an eight pole machine okay uh, moment of energy is 0.05 kg meter square and force okay this all the data you can obtain from the manufacturer so it's uh, nothing to be deal with and here is a 400 volt three phase voltage source with uh, star connected and the neutral point is grounded so this is a one rotor type so i have connected three phase uh, uh, resistor branch of 10 ohm in each phase and i have plotted the uh, rpm speed uh, starter voltage and rotor voltage okay so, and here is the input uh, or output in this case this is output if we if you put here minus sign then it will act as an induction generator and if you put here the positive value then it acts as an induction motor okay so that's all about the details so we now run the simulation and you will find the output as as like this okay this is simple you can understand it this is the star voltage of normal 50 hours frequency and this is the rotor rotor voltage it has different frequency you can calculate by uh, either doing Fourier analysis or something other ways of calculating frequency or you can just uh, calculate the total time between two crests of the uh, output sorry rotor voltage okay and this is the output speed initially uh, since it's a wound rotor motor and that due to the resistance it has high initial torque so due to the high initial torque it will have higher velocity initially due to the constant load so an inertia too and it will have initially higher speed but gradually at a steady state it will be in constant steady uh, constant steady state you can calculate manually in your uh, exercise book okay and this is all all thing about the induction motor so thank you for watching this video you can ask me in comments for for any other details you would like to know okay thank you for watching this